This episode of Hack 5 is brought to you by Toyota. For Hack 5, I'm Darren Kitchen here at CES 2014, and I am taking a look at the Geonaut. We looked at this last year when it was just in its prototype phase, and we're actually looking at very close to the final product. This is a really exciting action camera here, but it's very different from most action cameras in that it actually takes a 360 degree field of view video. That's right, it actually has three 8 megapixel cameras attached here. It's got a like I said, 360 degree horizontal field of view and about 150 degree vertical. And what's really cool is it actually stitches all that video together in the camera. So what you get out of it is actually a something like 2048 by 1024 pixel H.264 file, with nice AAC audio and all of that stuff. Um, it's a really novel concept. Uh, previously, you could actually hack together something like this using, say, six GoPro cameras and some ridiculous mountain you'd look awesome um, i'm sure this doesn't look any more ridiculous than google glass so you know whatever that's the the price of being a geek honestly and uh this is pretty cool they've got some mobile apps that actually allow you to play back these video files and just kind of like either use the accelerometer on the you know uh, ios or android device to kind of tilt and pan them around with or you can just touch around them. Uh, you can import it into their, got like, of course, as everyone does, a, a cloud-based ecosystem where you can import your videos into there and all your other friends can see it. Or if you just want to put it on YouTube, you can actually just export the file, bring it into any regular video editing system. And it, it, you can kind of see it a little bit of bowing at the bottom where it stitches it together, but it doesn't seem too bad. It seems like a pretty cool tool if you were to say, just want to record and not have to care about where you're pointing the camera. Right now, Sarah knows that she's pointing the camera at me in the future, so you could just put the camera on a stick and not have to worry about it, and then we'd be able to pan around, you'd be able to see Sarah and be like, wow, look at those awesome camera people at Hack 5. I don't know, seems pretty cool. Uh, they're actually demoing it with Oculus Rift, so that's kind of cool. Um, it's not actually available at this very moment, but uh, they do have a reserve right now. If you go to their website, you can go ahead and reserve yourself a unit. It is kind of pricey at 500 bucks, but there's nothing really else like it, and it seems pretty cool. Two hours of battery life, and um, otherwise just seems like a nifty gadget. And you know what, I love nifty gadgets. So check it out, the Geo. Thanks once again to Toyota for sponsoring our CES coverage.